Happy Valentine's. I hope you're all having a amazing day, whether it's with someone you love or if it's just you and your self-love. I just hope you have a great day. I had to do at least one look this Valentine's week where I am completely pink. I've wanted to do a look like this for so long. So what better chance to do it on Valentine's Day? So as you can see, I've covered myself in pink face paint and then I've gone in with a darker pink and I've started to contour my face so I do my cheekbones my forehead and also my jawline down my neck I find that this just makes a full colored makeup look pop and it just makes it look really cool it gives it dimension and it makes it not look really flat so the face paint I've been using is by Snazaroo of course and then the brush I used is by Primark and then I just went over the contour with an eyeshadow and a big fluffy brush just to make it a bit more prominent because I thought that I just blended it in a bit too much so by doing this it just makes the cheekbones really really stand out and also I highlight my nose and I also bring this onto my cheeks this is just light pink face paint that I've blended out I use a really really light fluffy brush to blend this out but you do have to do it quite quickly before it dries as you can see here it can get a bit patchy otherwise. I then use my Becca highlight in Rose Quartz. I always feel like I say that completely wrong but again I just apply that on highlighted areas so my cheekbones, a bit on my forehead, my nose. So moving on to the eyes I prime them with a concealer and then I just blend that out with a damp beauty sponge. This one is by Real Techniques and I set that with a really light pink eyeshadow just so it matches the rest of the colour that is on my face. To contour the eye I go in with a much darker pink. I say darker pink, it's more like a bright fuchsia pink but compared to the rest of my face it does look quite dark. And I also go into a red eyeshadow as well really lightly just to add some warmth to it. I bring that same colour down to the outer corner of my bottom lash line and blend it in to the outer corner of my lid. I then fill in my brows with a really really light pink face paint. Using that same colour I draw a line underneath each eye as I'm going to be turning these into some arrows and I then move on to the area just above the crease of my eye and I paint four hearts on each eye. To finish off the arrows that are underneath my eye I go into a purple face paint and on the end of the line that is closest to my eyeball I paint a heart and on the other end of the line I draw an arrowhead. I then decided I wanted to have a white winged eyeliner so what I did is use a pigment and some inkblot duraline and just created a white eyeliner. I used a really detailed brush for this and I didn't want the wing to be too big so compared to other stuff that I've done the winged eyeliner is quite small. For my lips I used the Lancome liquid lipstick in pink power and then I top that with the Huda Beauty metallic lip gloss in Shameless. And lastly, I put on some mascara and the lashes that I used for this makeup look are by Tinker Beauty and they're in the style 621. To make this look a little bit more like a glam cupid, I put on this white wig and styled it. I also created some arrows and it was exactly the same arrows that I used in the Love Struck video. I'll have that come across the screen now if you want to check that out. But I just put two of them arrows in my hair and I also have one as like a little prop. So this is the fifth look out of my Valentine's series. I have eight in total, so Valentine's Day might be over tomorrow, but it's not on this channel. If you do not want to miss any more of my Valentine's inspired makeup looks that are coming in the next few days, make sure you hit the subscribe button down below and that notification bell. If you like this makeup look, make sure to hit the thumbs up button down below and let me know in the comments what you would like to see next month. I'm currently planning it all out right now and I'm a little bit stuck. So if you would like to see anything on my channel like a specific makeup look make sure to let me know in the comments down below thank you so much for watching and i'll see you tomorrow in my next video bye